Wow, here we go, guys, back to MMA. Fight number five of the night. Here we go, Richardson versus Hill. Richardson in the red corner, Hill in the blue corner. God, Richardson throwing bombs, Julian. Swinging for the fences. Beautiful body kick. Ooh, Santa Guillotine. Oh, Action right in front of us. Might have this finish here, it's tight. Very tight. Wow, Richardson trying to get out of it. Beautiful takedown, he's able to get. Do you think he got tighter? Right now, he's in the position, oh, okay. Actually, he doesn't need to, all right, there we go. <laughs> he's safe now. I was gonna say, you can get guillotine from mount still, but apparently he felt safe, didn't have the guillotine, and now he's in mount. We can just dominate position. Looks like he's trying to pin the arm down. Passing to side control, just staying heavy on top. Wow, beautiful heart um, by Michael Richardson. Definitely, that guillotine looked tight. For an arm choke? You really see the angle there. It looks like he's just staying heavy on top. Elijah's kind of holding him down, trying to make sure that he can't do exactly what he's doing now, getting some strikes off, doing some damage. Now, beautiful transition to the back and uh, hunting for the throat now. Jill, the table is shaking now. Jillian's excited. This is like in her alley. We're going throat cuddles. We're uh, transitioning to the back. This is your world. This is what I asked for. I wanted a submission <laughs> finish, so hopefully we get to see it. Hooks in there by Richardson. Good transition into Mount here, but he's, he's, he's happy here on the back. It's going to be a battle here. Who can ever who can turn in faster? If Hill can turn in, he can turn into his guard or um, pull into mount. Yeah. To me, like, Hill should be going inside right now, right? Yeah, uh, he was turning the right direction, then started going the opposite. He putting himself in a little bit of a worse position here. Right, right. But that's the inexperience. This is something that he should go back to the drawing board, but ah, oh, inside here. That's why there's amateur. You get all that experience. This is the time to test all that. Oh, rear oh. it could be in. Deep in with that choke there. Oh, so close. <laughs> Ten seconds left to round one. Can Hill make it out of round one? Wow. Richardson just dominating completely positionally on the ground, just flowing from mount to back, doing what he wanted. Never really able uh, to capitalize on uh, any huge strikes, but just to, able to dominate positionally. I am always so intrigued, and I see it now at high levels of the UFC, when someone tries to uh, multiple submission attempts, especially, you know, try for the rear naked, multiple 30 seconds, 45 seconds, where are your, your arms at? Are, is he dead here? Is he gonna have a little bit short? It's, I'm so intrigued to see now here in round two. Depends how much he really committed to those chokes. If he's still really squeezing for him, it, it might be. But even uh, Elijah early was squeezing on that guillotine. That can be taxing his arms. I, I, I uh, submitted Cam Bennett Island Fights, uh, you know, under the belt with a little guillotine. My arms are still a little bit still tired. You know, it's been eight hours. How, how's your throat feeling after our round? Um, All right, guys, on to the round two. <laughs> Uh, there's no proof of that uh, action. Uh, sparring session between Jillian, Savage Robinson, and myself. No proof. All right, round two here, guys. Hill in blue, Richardson in red. Richardson smiling to start the round. Oh, big throw in right. Bombs, his chin is wide open, though. Even his chin up there. Uh, action right in front of us. Wow, Hill takes him out. Wow, what a difference right now, a cage. A cage would be a very, very tight little spot there by Richardson, but he might get saved here by the ropes. Elijah kind of What's falling off the side there, and uh, looks like he's getting into the, more of a half guard position. Right, and this could get 
backfire with Richardson maybe being on top. What's the first thing you think of when you see these ropes? Oh, no. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, just as a grappler, like it makes it so much harder to deal with. You can uh, just create so much more space, especially oh, transition to the back here. We might be looking for the throat again. To me, it's pride. Like I, I walk out in this big arena, I'm like, oh, pride. It's the first thing I think of. Just adds a whole new obstacle to the sport. Richardson really trying to get this rear naked here in round two. Tell Richardson just very comfortable here on the ground. What does he need to do to secure this finish? Uh, Elijah Hill is just doing a very good job at keeping his chin tucked in. Uh, it's making it very difficult. Uh, this is personally, I'm not a huge fan of putting the hooks in because now you're sitting here and you're fighting, you're fighting the throat, you're fighting the hands, and it's going to be very difficult to sing that choke. And it, uh, it, it's just when somebody's that aware. <laughs> Wow, it was funny. Uh, we're right next to him here. You can see the action right in front of us. We heard Richardson kind of talking to him a little bit there. Definitely, uh, wow, Hill with a nice little transition of his own now in full guard. Elijah's still looking to score points, just throwing a little short strikes to the body. Richardson seems to slow down a lot here. It looks like he's just trying to more um, stall and control position. It's I like that, especially with 20 seconds left. I think he's definitely done enough to win the round. It's like, hey, let's just kind of take a little break. Let's have a minute and a half of a break going into round three. Taking a lot of body shots in that break, though. <laughs> wow, yeah, Hill trying to throw some big shots here around two. Yeah, Richardson very slow to his corner of round three. Worse, I always hear all the time when I talk to you know fighters, it's not they don't fear the knockout or they don't fear what the opponent could do to them. They fear being exhausted. The cardio just out of you and you got nothing left. Oh, there's nothing worse when your arms give up on you. Yeah, it doesn't even feel necessarily like you can't breathe. It's just your body stops working. Your your arms are done, your legs are done, and you just you feel like you can't move. Yeah, Hill standing up, got positive, you know, looks real positive. Alexander Shank, one of the fight of the nights there for Jorge Masvidal's Icon Fight Championship. Richardson looks absolutely gassed here going into round three. that body language can make a huge difference. Especially to the judges. They're seeing this. Uh... Richardson's trying to keep him away with leg kicks, head kicks, body kicks. <laughs> wow. Tried through a massive kick. Looks like he slipped. Hill's on top. Two minutes and 30 seconds. There's got to be nothing worse than you're absolutely exhausted. you got a man on you just throwing heavy bombs. There's just no getting out of this right now, looks like, for Michael Richardson. He's still trying his hardest. He's struggling, trying to get to his feet, creating a scramble here. Oh, and uh, going for the legs. Risky play to end up in a position like this. Richardson just really trying to control posture, stop Elijah from doing damage, and it's exactly what he's doing, just throwing body shots consistently. Alexander Shank in the corner of Elijah Hill said he's tired, he does not want to be here. Elijah Hill trying to maybe move into mount, back into the side control here. Richardson keeping that bottom knee high every time he tries to do it, so it's making it difficult for him to really step over. 
insight from the Savage right there. One minute left here, guys, of round three. Elijah Hill at the blue corner, red corner, Michael Richardson. Could be the deciding round, could be the last minute here. I always wonder this too. I, uh, Xander in the corner of Elijah Hill. Looks like he's dominating the round, but not very happy with him, almost with a negative tone. Is it the judges hear that? Is that something that can pers you know, persuade a, a judge to lean one way or the other? I'm not necessarily sure if it persuade the judges, but uh, as a fighter, it's like, well, as a coach, you want to see your fighter get the finish, and he's pushing Ooh. for that. She's getting here, a beautiful knockdown. Kind of looked like an inside leg kick that kind of got the back of Richardson's lead knee. Oh, he's just, Hill oh, big body, body shots shot. here. Yeah. Wow. Exciting way to round Beautiful three. Beautiful end to the round. How would you call that fight? Elijah Hill. Elijah Hill, I loved to, uh, round one was close, probably leading Richardson, but round two was domination, I think, on the ground by Hill, a lot of ground and pound. And then round three, Elijah Hill with a great finish. Here's the highlights of the fight. There's that slip. Such an unlucky moment. This is the start of the finish for him, really. Right. He kind of really never gained control of the fight after that. Ooh. Michael Richardson marked up, more marked up on his face than I thought. Elijah Hill looks like in great spirits. Great fight, fifth fight of the night. Rolling through, 11's gonna be done quick. This is early night, we're going out for dinner again soon. Great action so far here, guys, at Island Fight 71. Elijah his hands raised, expecting the win. All right, let's hear what the judges think. Elijah Hill thinks he's got the W. Let's see about the three judges judging this card. Christopher James with the verdict. Uh, ladies and gentlemen, after three rounds of action inside the ring, we go to our judges' scorecards for a decision. All three judges score the bout identically. 29-28 for your winner by unanimous decision. From the blue corner, Elijah Silent Hill. 